it's fine, come to think of it Till you pull me right back Why did you have to do that? Gonna Get Over You is a surprisingly challenging song to crack the code on, mainly because we found the feel that we really wanted in the chorus that's super pocketed and tight that everybody loves. And Abigail and I went back and forth a couple different times on the pre-chorus trying to figure out how we engage the listener when they hit that first pre-chorus, but don't take away from the special feel of the chorus. So after a lot of back and forth, we figured out the kind of pre-course that we wanted to live in and land on and the way that we did that was I figured out what I was looking for were was an instrumentation to accent the hits of her melody that she sings so the way that I did that was I started building out the hits first and I did that with the kick in 808 and just added a backbeat with claps right so each of those hits accent what she's saying in the pre-chorus and then i grabbed a loop from splice i think it's in the oliver modern um, power tools pack and i chopped it up exactly how i wanted that way it's playing exactly what i want so all together the loop in that pre-chorus sounds like this then i added the tom fills to get us into the second section and then ultimately the epic tom fill to get us into the chorus Right. So then we finally felt like the pre-chorus had its own moment without taking away from what the chorus was. And as you can see, all of my instrumentation on that pre-chorus as well, I chopped up so there are hard starts and stops on everything. That way the instrumentation does the exact same thing that the loop is doing. So all together it sounds like this. <laughs> We finally heard it in that context it was the first time that we were actually really excited about the pre-chorus so if you put abigail's lead vocal in there with that melody it sounds like this finally we get to that chorus so the other part of Gonna Get Over You that makes the song so iconic is obviously the, the pocket of the chorus. And after we kind of figured everything out, I knew that I wanted everything in that chorus to be extremely tight and extremely staccato so that we could play with Abigail's voice a little bit more and play with some background vocal counter melodies to, to make it a little more unique. So if you notice, all of the instrumentation that's happening in the chorus is all very staccato. There's really nothing legato happening until the guitar lead line in the post-chorus. So if you listen to just the synths, guitars, and keys in the chorus, you'll notice everything is just super tight and staccato. And all just following her hook. Put her vocal in there. Taking it to the There's your first legato element of the guitar lead line. So what we ended up doing was when we tracked her vocals, we wanted to find some counter melodies that complement but also play against her actual melody. So if you notice, when we get to the choruses, all of the background vocals are, are playing a vital role in the really the instrumentation of the track. So if we go to the chorus. When we started tracking background vocals, we wanted to find that melody together. So I had her end up singing this little counter melody thing. Sounds like this. I was right there on the brink. Actually. I was right there on the brink of it. I was doing just fine. Come to think of it till you. Right. So you have one melody and then a separate melody playing against it. So we ended up tracking that with her background vocals. And that with her lead vocal sounds like this. 
I was right there on the brink of it I was doing just fine Come to think of it till you pulled me right back Why did you have Same to thing on the back, back half Thinking it through Did you mean to call you Set me right up for another fall Like you always right, And then last but not least um, Just to kind of help support those background vocals I vocoded her lead vocal um, To the whole progression of the chorus So with the vocoder well, here's the vocoder on its own. I was right there on the brink of it. I was doing just fine. Come to think of it till you pulled me right back. Why did you have to do that? You throw that counter melody in against that, it sounds like this. I was right there on the brink of it. I was doing just fine. Come to think of it till you pulled me right back. Why did you have to do that? Right. So good. And then you throw her lead vocal back in there with all of that, and you get this just like incredible, lush palette of vocals. I was right there on the brink of it. I was doing just fine. Come to think of it till you pulled me right back. Why did you have to do that? You throw the staccato stuff in behind it. Through, did you mean to call you set me right up for another fall like you always do? I was gonna so you just kind of have this perfect sounding song. Set me right up. 